Daisy Tui, I'm the Frugal Chef. I hope you're doing really well today. If you haven't subbed and you do so, thank you very much for that. I have to do this click right here. Let's make some cereal bars today. These are awesome for lunch boxes or for snacks. I like to sometimes cut them into little squares and have them as bites. They're very easy to make. On the website, I will give you different options of different things you can put in them if you want to kind of vary this recipe. But I do want to tell you these can be vegan. At the end, you'll see me. I'm going to uh, mix some peanut butter with vanilla and honey. If you change the honey for uh, brown sugar syrup or agave, you have a vegan version of these cereal bars. I hope you like this. Let's make it. The first thing we're going to do is uh, toast a little bit of oats. I have two cups here. I'll put the grams on the recipe, okay? This is not instant oats, guys. It's rolled oats. We're going to put this in an oven at 325 degrees Fahrenheit. That's about 165, I guess, centigrade. doesn't have to be exact. And I'm going to toast it for about 10 minutes. I'm going to shake this every three minutes, let's say. I'm going to add half a cup of bran to this, of wheat bran. As some of you know, I'm here in Bolivia, so I'm going to use amaranth for this. Uh, it might not be so easy for you guys to find this. You don't need to worry about it. I'm going to put a whole cup in here. If you can get some uh, quinoa flakes, for example, you can substitute it with that. Or just add another uh, cup of oatmeal, okay? If you add another cup of oatmeal...
25 pieces. I'm gonna cover this with plastic and put it in the fridge for four hours, minimum, okay? You can leave it overnight, and I will see you when they're ready. And here are our bars. They are wonderful. They are nice and moist and so, 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 so tasty. Look at that, kind of chewy, delish. Mmm, these are so good. Mmm, 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 mmm. 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 Um, I like wrapping each one individually in foil and then just having them, they'll keep for a long time, put them in the fridge pop them into lunch boxes, eat one as a snack, cut them in little, you know, squares, have them as bites, whatever you want. I have the recipe on the website waiting for you guys to come and print it. In the meantime, eat well without going broke, and I'm going to see you soon.